a great team win overall, and Nestor was once again nasty. What made him so effective this afternoon? Uh, I mean, he was just pounding the zone, uh, pound zone with all his pitches, and just attacking guys, and that's what uh, that's what really makes him nasty. He changes things up so much on the mound. Does that really keep you on your toes behind the plate? Maybe not always knowing what he's going to do out there. Yeah, I. Uh, I got a chuckle in at that one strikeout uh, where he just like did that crazy motion. So that was that was fun. How much do you feel like he's evolved as a pitcher this year? We saw it towards the end of last season, but it seems like he took even bigger step forward this season. Yeah, I think he's just coming into his own. Um, he just being himself out there and then this is who we know he is and I, I think he'll keep doing it. Seems like you've been getting more opportunity lately and you've been making the most of it. Did you change anything about your approach at the plate that has led to your success? Uh, just starting in the second half just try to hit you know a few more line drives. Um, you know if I'm hitting in the bottom of the order I got to get on base for for a judgey to drive me in with a homer or Rizzo or Stanton or anybody else. So I mean uh, you know, just just trying to hit line drives and get on base. You mentioned John Carlos, Dan. When you see him hit it like he did in that first inning, do you think that could be a sign of things to come? Yeah, I mean, we all know who Big G is, so um, you know he's he he knows how to get it dialed in, and and I think he's right there. Kyle, thanks for the time. Congratulations on the win. Thanks, Meredith. Send it back to you.